Hello everyone and welcome to the final episode on the RS2000 project. Let's have a little recap, shall we? Go for it. happens to be a hole, Governor. <gasps> hole number two. And it's taking a lot of paint off. Bing. Mask up for paint. So what's happened? Back sheared off. The last bloody the box. Last. And this one is going to come free from it. Whatever it is. Right, Lewis has repaired the studs. Yeah. Uh, just a real quick tidy up at the bottom edge. But there we go, look at that. We did um, we some flanged bolts of the right sort of thread, so just ground the nuts part of it off so it was left with like a circle, which is what they have. Really and I just quickly is. tacked them on and sprayed it black. Final bit. some new screws to put in the top here so that's not screwed in we can put the screws in there so we can might wait for some new screws in the side as well um, basically it's attached to the car all the big stuff attached so we shall get started on masking up to paint the black windscreen in first okay windscreen and rear screen? I think we can put the rear screen in. Okay, so a bit of glass in and then we'll carry on. A uh, bit of string theory going on over here. String theory? Yeah. Right, this is Lewis's tried and tested method. This is the way. This is the way for putting in the windscreens. Bit of, bit of rope around in the old rubber. We have already, I have already greased around the hole, so if any moisture ever does get into there, it's going to be protected. protected. has come to put on the black swoop. We have our measurements from where it was before that the lovely Leanne has um, taken for us, haven't you Mrs? Yep, we have a record of everything on this car. So what we have to do is follow these measurements and recreate it. Recreate the scoop.
last night I left Lewis to paint the black. And uh, shall we go and have a look, see what it looks like? Yeah. Come to have a look at the black. Good morning. You come to look at the black. I have come to look at the black. That's good news because we have black. All right, we masked up last night and I went home and left Lewis to paint the black. It's, ooh, look at that. It's looking okay, isn't it? It's looking beautiful. Nice, nice. Nice. It's nice. It's nice enough. So look at this back panel. All masking's gone okay. Masking's beautiful. And uh, from where the original lines were, we sanded through the layers, and the original black lines were still there, so we used them as the masking. Mm. Maybe if the black swoop looking good. We're going to be taking this masking off today. Yes. And getting ready for a final polish. Now this car, because it is the first RS2000, they actually painted the spare wheel bulb black, didn't they? I don't know why they bothered painting one bit down there black. They just did. They didn't bother with the cells or anything, just that. They no. Just paint that bit black. Just that. Anyway. We obviously change later on. Here we go, lovely black swoop, lovely window rails. Looking beautiful and the last one oh we've also refurbed the um, rear bumper and the badges here we go one beautiful rear bumper oh yeah all the badges and these little hockey sticks and these bumper brackets oh the paint's Still curing a little bit, but looking amazing. Looks good, right? So yep. um, let's get a move on. We've got to, today we're going to unmask this thing and finish putting the windows in, and finish putting every single thing that we have to put back on, put it back on. So the last thing we have to do is a final polish and it can go. Is that? Hold on, let me just tidy up my bit. Yeah, tidy up your bit. Here you go. Tidy up my bit. There you go. Thank you to all our lovely Patreons who are keeping Lewis in Haribo and M&M's. <laughs> <laughs>
I'll be honest though, my gran bought me these. is stage two um, of compounding finished. Everywhere has had a nice buff. I've checked over everything. There's no more flatting marks in anything. So that's good. We are, we are making good progress. So the next stage is ceramic finish. This is the final stage of polishing. This should leave a really nice Ooh, finish. Nice. An ooh finish. Ooh. If very, yeah, that's a good finish. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So on this stage we'll be using a waffle head mm -hmm. and a nice clean microfiber and this ceramic stuff. Basically doing the same thing but with a <laughs> All over finer, again. finer, 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 more, more finer compound. Yeah. Um, don't use that. That's just a bad. Cool. Oh! Oh, it's very really liquidy. Oh, it looks like a shark. What kind of shark is that? Hold on. A dog shark. A dog shark? Yeah, that, that's his fins. This is head. It looks more like a frog. Right then guys, this is it. We are we're done. Finished. Finished polishing. 
finished putting it back together the as much as we're going article. to. It's now um, going to go somewhere else to get the rebuild finished, get the yeah. engine back in, transmission, running seats, gear, doors, seats, everything else engine, is getting done somewhere else. Rear lights, wheels, suspension, brake lines, fuel lines, the petrol tank. Lot. Not an aerial because we welded that whole up. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, but this is it. It's it's beautiful. It is been a really good project this one. We've really enjoyed it. A few surprises yeah. along the way. Oh yeah. But we have really enjoyed doing that this. Gearbox one. tunnel, bloody hell. Ooh, the reshaping of that, gosh. But now it is stunning and if you have seen it, this is the one at the NEC Classic Car Show. This was the one on the Ford stand. I mean <sighs> We, we, we couldn't show you before because we were asked not to release it until after the after the big reveal. So here is the first reveal of the paint. <laughs> yeah, no. Um, it's beautiful. Really, it's been a great job. It. It's been a great job. It's great been job. it's been lots of fun. Um, lots of late nights. Well, a few late nights pushing pushing through. We pushed through. We uh, we came out came out the other end victorious. We did. So um, it's well worth it. So. Thank you for, for following us along this, this journey of restoration and... Don't um, forget to subscribe. What if are we doing next? What's the next project? Talbot. Ooh, Ooh not a Lotus Sunbeam Talbot. A Lotus Sunbeam. <gasps> now that'll be good. Oof. So stay tuned next week and it might be Volvo, it might be Talbot. Who knows what yeah, it's going to be? We might have bought something but, uh, else. <laughs> but um, yeah. Don't forget to subscribe, subscribe and if you'd like to get a heads up of projects that are on the way before anybody else, you can sign up to our Patreon. The link is in the description. Yeah. Have fun. Thanks for watching. Bye. Signing out.